Are you one of the millions of people who watched Squid Game? Are you a writer? Here are three lessons that writers can learn from Squid Game and, yes, some spoilers ahead. While a lot of death game genre shows employ stock bland characters to just kill off by the dozen, Squid Game spends a lot of time in the first two episodes allowing us to know a few of the key characters and continues to develop them throughout the series. So that when some of them die later, that matters. The stakes of the games matter. There's emotional depth to a story that might have otherwise been empty spectacle. The show has a specific structure. In the first episode, we learn that there's going to be six games across six days, which allows the audience a sense of structure right off the bat. And this allows us to know that there's danger ahead without telling us exactly what that danger is. Understanding the structure of the story from the beginning can help create a scaffolding for the plot's building tension. And finally, the show is more than just about some death game. The show reflects a deep anxiety about modern life, not just in South Korea, but around the world. A lot of people identify with the desperation of the characters, which makes us even more invested in the show. As writers, we can watch and enjoy media, but we can also learn lessons about storytelling, lessons we can carry into our own work.